everyone, welcome back to another video, and I got some happy mail today. Um, the Viva Las Vegas design team members are doing a swap with the Gosh Alchemy um, design team. And they're getting some um, stamps from us, from Viva Las Vegas stamps. And we're getting some of their uh, mixed media ephemera stuff from them. And I thought it was really cool when I found out <laughs> when we um, were doing a swap with them because last year I tried out for their design team. So I knew what they had and all kinds of stuff. So I knew it was going to be good stuff. So this is what it came in, the box. So to you can totally reuse this. Then it was wrapped in this brown paper and then it had was had the um this blue lace bow wrapped around it and one of their cards and then um it was all wrapped in this clear envelope you can also use that so here's all the goodies. Well, some of the goodies. This is, I think, this is what we got is a sampling of what they have. So their kit, they have different kits and stuff. And monthly kits. And like I said, you can check out their website and their store. I think this is um, a sampling of their color kits. I got the purple. I got um, a hair bow thing, um, Mr. Ford. I'll go through this later. Oopsie. So I got this big piece of lace. Black. Really cool. And then I got some a good uh, selection of Punchinella that they carry. This big one and some teeny tiny one. I think this is hexagon. No, a circle and heart. And more circles, and more circles, and some more little ones, another thing of big ones. And then they have a, a kit, or whatever you want to call it, of napkins. You get each, I forget how that how many napkins you get in a package but you get like one you know a bunch of different napkins and everybody we all got different ones and I love this one <laughs> and then the back and then here's all their um, book paper, papers and stuff so I got some foreign text it looks like a math book. <laughs> That's kind of funny because I don't do math. <laughs> that will definitely be used <laughs> in some foreign text. I'm not sure if it's Japanese or Chinese. I used to be able to tell which was which when I was working uh, sensitivity book then we got some pages from the Sears catalog Be hard to you tear up and use. <laughs> There's 
another one. It's another catalog. Dress for two eighty nine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just have to look at the prices. Look at that. Then we got an ad. And answers to quizzes, and then we got big music sheet and then I got book, another book paper see what I want to use the text but I want to you know keep that save that but on the other side there's text here <laughs> and a picture here what to do, what to do. That's really cool for being you know, Victorian and stuff. It's, that's so not me, but still cool. So that's that. And I'll go through this and hopefully everything doesn't spill. So I got this paper clip. And I know I got some fling. The feathers. Support for my game. And the cat. Hug. And mesh. Cupcake liner. Some feathers. A crown. Bottle cap. Paper clip. A button. I think, um, like I said, bling. Some. Sequence <laughs> Monopoly Game Piece another Monopoly Some Yarn Bread A Label Another Label Band Aid I think Another piece of so that's my kit, and I think what I'll be doing, my project, here's a little preview. I already just sold all this because it was on wood, but it's from Stamp in the Hand. So oh, I have this years and years and years and years, and it sat in my filing cabinet, filing cabinet for a long time because I had no idea what to do. Um, it's a wooden tic-tac-toe game set that can be stamped, painted, and decorated to evolve into a fun work of art. You can use the game board separately as a window pane frame or with the wooden tic-tac-toe pieces. You can also make separate pins out of the tic-tac-toe pieces. So these are the pieces. And I already just sold everything last night just to prep. And this is the game board now. I don't know if you can see. This is gonna drive me nuts. <laughs> I noticed it when I was just sewing um, the frames. If you, if you can see, it's kind of uneven. That side is bigger, is smaller than that side, and that's a little. The middle is a little uh, smaller. It's like they didn't sp space them good, but the pieces all fit, which is kind of weird. But there's like some have more room. Oops, some have more room than others. 
you know, there's more space here than here and here. <laughs> that kind of drives me crazy. But we shall see what I should come up with. And the fun thing with these kits is you can use stuff from your own stash too, so. It's exciting what everyone will come up with. And, um, so stay tuned for next month. So thanks for watching.